happen in this room today if I were to tell you that I don't personally believe that Eve ate the apple or whatever fruit it was. I don't personally believe that Eve ate the apple because she was hungry. I don't believe she didn't have no groceries. She was like, man, I'm starving. And this dude suckered her into eating the apple. I don't believe that. But could I suggest to you that what really happens is she failed to understand who she was. And even though she had information, she didn't have understanding. And that confusion opened her to seductive voices that sabotaged her destiny. See, if you don't understand who you are, anybody that comes along and has an agenda for your life may be able to seduce you into their environment so they can take advantage of who you are and manipulate the future of your life. I came to tell somebody, the devil is a lie. We are not going to keep losing people to a seductive voice. There is a teacher present, and he's going to teach us how to live as the sons and daughters of God. What if I told you that I believe the reason the devil showed up as a serpent is not because he's a snake? Because in the Bible, he has many metaphors. He's called a serpent. He's called a dragon. He's called an angel. So you have to read the Bible in context of the metaphors. So when he shows up as a serpent, it's because, have you ever read the children's story Bible? Got all the stories in it about creation. Got all the pictures, giraffes and zebras, elephants. They were in an environment that was full of animals. So to show up like an animal was not to cause alarm. It fit the environment. Oh, I'm going, I'm going somewhere. <laughs> See, I'm here to suggest to you today that, that sometimes the devil doesn't show up as a serpent. On your job, he shows up as a coworker. And at your family reunion, he shows up like your cousin. And at church, he shows up like some crazy church person. Because the devil never shows up as the devil. Because if he showed up as the devil, you'd say, no, no, I don't want nothing to do with the devil. But when he shows up looking like the environment you're in, it makes sense to your natural mind. So if you've never been taught, you don't know how to cast down these vain imaginations that are coming to you that don't make sense. I'm telling you, many times... People don't recognize the devil because he looks like he fits the moment. I mean, you know, a lie doesn't come dressed like a lie. I need a teacher. I need somebody to teach me how to discern voices, how to understand truth. Do you realize that most of the people that have held people in captivity and done horrible things to people's lives have used this book to do it? You want to know why many people of color are being seduced by voices in our nation to tell them not to be Christians because Christianity is a white man's religion? Y'all, all, all you white folks, just give me a moment. I'm going to preach. I'm going to help us understand something. Everybody else in the building understands something. You want to know why that's being propagated in our nation over time right now? You want to know why that's being propagated, particularly in the disadvantaged places of America? Because white men use this Bible to propagate that slavery was God's idea. Oh 
Because if you ain't got no understanding, you'll take a Bible verse and beat somebody to death with it. You'll take a Bible verse and pull it out of context and make somebody feel like God is never going to forgive them. God's finished with them. God's wrote them off and there's no hope for them. You can use the Bible to say anything you want to, but you need a teacher to teach you how to understand what this book means. Hey, I trust this word today just blessed your life. I hope there was something that enlarged you uh, and created faith to come alive on the inside of you. I'm always grateful for people who join us. Let me encourage you to do a couple of things. First of all, if you haven't followed me on social media, would you do that? Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, go look right now for Tony Miller TV. It's at Tony Miller TV on all formats. And you can follow and be up to date with things that we're doing. I'd love for you to invite your friends also, go to my website, TonyMiller.tv, for all the things that are coming to your area near you very, very soon. Once again, thanks for joining us today.